everybody. I just finished my workout for today and I just wanted to go over uh, the 360s with you a little bit. Um, I just finished the 360 challenge which I'll be posting up so you can check that out. Um, but before I do I want to give you a couple tips uh, if you're learning uh, 360s or if you're progressing in weight. Um, uh, as you can see, um, I have two different weights here. Uh, today I did the 360 challenge with the 20, um, and this is the 10. So there's quite a big difference there. So um, when you are doing the challenge, if you're progressing in weight or you're learning uh, the 360s right now, going through uh, the foundations program online, uh, you can choke your hands up the maze. So if you're doing the 360s and they don't feel um, great for you or the ball feels heavy, just slide your hands up slightly just to make the weight feel a little more secure and more stable. Um, so that when you do take it up and overhead, it doesn't feel like it's so far away from you. Um, so you can see with the 10 pound, that moves smoothly for me. Um, but with the 20 pound, it takes a little bit more work. So I tend not to hold it right at the bottom of the handle. I slide my hands up just a little bit further than I would with the 10 pound, um, just so that when I am taking the 20 around, it feels really good and solid. Don't forget to keep it nice and tight to your body. That will also really make a difference when you pull it back down and you settle here for a second. So just make sure that you catch it right here, nice and tight, and pull those hands right down to your belly button. If they're floating out here, this is gonna feel a lot more wobbly, wobbly and you're not gonna feel in control of that. So um, especially for this challenge that I'm gonna post up, I need you to really focus on pulling that in back into position and steadying the mace before you give it another go. If you're looking for more information on how to use the mace um, or how to 360, the drills that go along with it, all of it's posted on my website, uh, which I just got up and going. So you can check that out there. All the foundation drills, exercises, and everything you need uh, just start using a steel mace is all on there. If you don't have a steel mace at home, let me know, I can hook you up. Um, we've been getting a lot out in our community here, which I'm so extremely grateful for. I can't say thank you enough to everybody who has supported uh, during this time. So I hope you guys are enjoying these at home sweaty workouts. As you can see, my glasses are fogged up, so uh, it's working. We don't need, you know, the gym. I mean, although it's beautiful there, uh, this works too, guys, and you guys are amazing. And I hope you have a really wonderful day.